Hey Leos, this is Simone, Moon Goddess CC. Thank you so much for checking my video. Um, this is a reading for the week beginning 10th of July to 17th of July. A general reading. So, let us get started. Okay, Leo. What messages do you have for Leo this week? Leo this week, Leo Sun, Leo Moon, Leo Rising. Thank you. What messages do you have for Leo this week? 10th of July to 17th of July. Leo this week. Leo, Leo, Leo. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Well. So under the deck for Leos this week is the Four of Wands. A general feeling of celebration, victory, harmony. Um, some of you guys might be getting married this week. Um, yeah, so at the center of this reading, you at this minute, Six of Cups. Um, reversed, sorry, Six of Cups reversed. So there's a feeling of maybe um sadness about something that's happened in the past looking back to look forward using any sadness or heaviness in order to progress through a situation through life um maybe somebody from your past reappearing but it might not necessarily be something that will help you to progress or maybe it's not great memories. This person doesn't bring great memories. Um, so your well-being and your personal development is lovers reversed. Um, this week for you, Leos, is a time to integrate feminine and masculine energies. Maybe Leo's tenth, your fire sign. There's lots of action, lots of activity, lots of go getting. Um, something needs to be balanced out. Whether it's the different elements of yourself, different aspects. Maybe it's time to to draw in a bit. Maybe it's time to bring some balance to yourself. For your own personal development, for your own well being. You know, maybe it's about bringing some, going back to a structure from the past that's worked for you in the past and has brought some balance to you in the past in order for you to then feel whole. I don't know, maybe it's a, a matter of meditation or some kind of spiritual, some kind of spiritual practice that you might have relied on in the past, something that has been able to help you to feel on even keel with your energies your vibes I'm just trying to feel it out for your home and family it's the Empress it's all about the love it's all about beauty it's all about um, connecting with with 
those who make you feel happy and make you feel abundant and connected. Um, she is, the Empress is ruled by the planet Venus, so there's lots of love involved. Um, and there's lots of divine feminine. Maybe that's what needs to be integrated into your for your well-being, your personal development. Feminine aspects of you might need developing or um, maybe you need to inject a bit of feminine energies into how you deal with your home and your family life. Um, maybe that's what you're looking at from your past situations as you were growing up or, you know, your family life, your home life that might help you to inject you know memories great memories from the past are now being able that you're now able to inject into your home life i don't know i just feel like there's home this week for leos i feel as if it's very beautiful energy very loving and soft and So much feminine vibes just flowing through for your love and partnership sector it's the world and it's, it's very much about completion so perhaps you're in a relationship where you feel as if all of the elements of the relationship bring balance and beauty and there's connection and you know um, it's, just, it's, it's like a completion and then with the four of wands at the bottom of the deck that's why I'm like hmm some of you Leos might be looking to get married this week or make take a relationship to the next step the next stage a stage um, you know you've taken all these steps as you've gone through the relationship and now you feel like you're at a stage where it's like a full circle it's completion or um it could also be that you single leos are about to meet there's a birthing of something new in your love sector this week it's like um it's almost like if she's in a womb you know being nurtured by all these beautiful elements fire earth air water and yeah perhaps you're going to meet somebody this week that and this is the beginning stage the beginning stages of it but it makes whoever this person is it's going to bring a lot of happiness into your life um and for those who are in a relationship right now i feel as if you're really happy if there's i mean even if the lovers is reversed there's still this is like divine love this is um maybe whatever you are looking at from your past is making you feel as if you're trying to block it's bring it's stirring up things from your past and it might feel familiar but it's not what you've dealt with because we're on a totally different vibe different shift different energies um so yeah don't look at a situation and automatically feel like you want to block it off because it reminds you of something from your past because that's not the case there's such beautiful energy for you this week there's so much love for leos this week in your work and career it's death and this actually came up for another group i think it was taurus i could be wrong but um death transformation end of a cycle newness coming in um time to look forward there's celebration in this maybe you're being offered a new job a new post um an increase maybe you're stepping out into your own starting a business for yourself um maybe 
you're seeing yourself in another light as far as your working career and you're realizing that what it is you're doing doesn't resonate with you on the inside but whatever is happening even though this is an ending it's coming with some beautiful energy and regardless of if the situation feels a bit heavy after death is life and the cycle continues so when we change our perspective about endings you really see that you have a beautiful opportunity for growth for doing what it is that you really want to do in your life your truth so leo wow beautiful beautiful beginnings love completion celebrations great week let's see keep flying out my hands but for some reason I don't feel as if I don't feel as if I can't explain it okay these two flew out of my hand peace and why reversed hmm let's see 23 Peace, essential meaning is freedom from attachment, radical acceptance. It doesn't get any better than this. A quiet mind, a heart fulfilled, freedom from want, and the soul satisfaction. The way to peace is through radical acceptance. Everything in your world is exactly as it should be. Harmony is beautiful. Enjoy it. Ah, lovely. Yeah, I really do see lots of harmony this week for... Leo, let's see the other card that practically jumped out of my hand, jumped out my hand, is Y reversed. So in this reverse position, it says sometimes subconsciously denying the truth may drive you toward a specific outcome that actually aligns with an intention hidden from your awareness. For example, you may want to be prominent in your profession, but your desire is not really about sharing your talents but about making yourself feel better because fame would cause people to admire and approve of you or you may want to reunite reunite with the partner who rejected you because you believe that your love continues to be strong but deep down what you really desire is to have the last word with that person now is the time for deep soul searching of the why that drives your choices what you uncover will set you free and bring you ever closer to the happiness you seek. So yeah, with the, with death in your work position, it might be, as I was saying, that whatever it is that you do doesn't resonate with you fully. And the cards are asking you for this week to ask yourself, why do I do certain things? Why do I think certain things? Why, what drives me? What, what's my motive? Generally this week, Leo, what beautiful cards. Lovers. The Empress. The world. I mean, death. Four major arcana cards four four leo amazing beautiful there's a lot happening this week there's a lot lot there are lots of shifts happening um divine guidance celebration beautiful thank you guys for checking my video for um supporting me i really do appreciate it please like share subscribe to my channel um and i will see you guys soon 
have a beautiful week, Leo, and yeah, take care. Bye-bye.